Greetings friends, welcome back. Today we are going to be create a bootstrap button. Uh, bootstrap has its own styles for button elements which look much better than the plain HTML ones. Yeah, so down here this is a plain HTML one. It's got this slight gray uh, gradient on it and an outline with the submit button. Uh, we want to create a new button element below our large kitten photo. Okay, so we've got our uh, large kitten photo. I guess they mean this one. And so this is the uh, this is one. So we're going to put our button here. Uh, if I type that in, you'll see that it just comes up right here. But that's not what we want. Um, we want to create a new button element below your large kitten photo. Give it the button and button default classes as well as the text of like. Okay, cool. So what we could do is, well, we could make it an A element, right? Um, we're going to make the href equal to the, that. So where we've got an a element, an anchor element here, and we want a, it, the the text to be like, but we want it to have a class equal to a uh, button. So already you see it shifted when we sh put the beat, the button text in there. So we want to add this in there, and then we we also want to make it button default. Cool, and so now it's got that. Now this is the, the difference in, this is a, an original HTML, this is a simple HTML button, and then this is a bootstrap button. Uh, if we run the tests, uh, you should have a new button. Okay, so it actually doesn't like that I'm doing it with the A element. You don't actually, you can do it with A, or you can do it with the actual word um, button. And then you just close button. So yeah. That was it. There's, there's actually uh, no real specific difference. The way that I do this, I use Bootstrap all the time to build web applications. This is one of the most useful uh, courses that we've done. Most of the stuff that you had before this, like um, the JavaScript, HTML, you needed to know all that stuff to be able to start understanding Bootstrap. But now that you're learning Bootstrap, you're, you're, using something, you're learning something that you really can use. So as you can see, it doesn't matter whether you have it as a button or a, a link. It's the exact same thing, but because this, uh, because free code camps uh, test, because their application uh, makes, makes sure to check for a button, you need to make sure you make it a button rather than an A element. Even though you could just make it an anchor element and it would work exactly the same way. So now that it's uh, set to button, um, we've got our like button here. We can run the test and they pass. Hope you guys enjoyed this one and we'll see you in the next lesson.